What's up, everybody? This is Rich from True Boy GDDC and Prepping. Use your gear, lose your gear, because if you're not using it, you might as well lose it. So just want to come on here today and do a quick go over of a pouch that I recently received. But I'd like to say uh, Happy New Year to everybody. I uh, hope you had a great uh, holiday season. It's over, so get back to work tomorrow. <laughs> but um, I hope everybody got everything they wanted for uh, Christmas, and I hope everybody has a blessed upcoming new year in 2024 so so this is a pouch that i got online um, on etsy actually from a company called stw superior threadworks there are a few videos out about them online but not a lot uh i've been looking at this pouch for a while i, I don't know why i didn't buy it sooner i put it in my cart and like forgot about it it was originally 35 bucks. I think it's $35 again, but it was on sale for Christmas, like 28 So when I picked it up, it was $28. Bucks. Uh, so let's go over the specs of it real fast before I really get into what's going on inside of it. Um, I wrote them all down. It just seems like it's going to be a good way in 2024 to get everything down, use my uh, log and jotters and everything, write stuff down so I'm good to go. So STW pouch, it does on the outside have a 2 by 4 loop panel. Uh, the materials on the outside are 1000D Cordura. Inside, 500D Cordura. These are number 8 nylon coil zippers, so they are not YKK. Um, it does have 1 inch nylon gripper elastic inside. All seams... Uh, and zippers are double stitched. The specs on the pouch are 3x5x1.75 by by uh, and it is 100% made in the United States. So this is the Woodland Camo pattern. Uh, it does have this patch on the outside. I put that on there. Actually, that's from like pull patch, I believe. And like I said, it's not YKK, but honestly, it's fine. It's got this. Uh, you can hook it on something with a carabiner or something if you wanted to. Uh, if you want to do that, it does have a paracord pull attached to the zipper. And really solid. You know, the Cordura is water resistant. Um, the only thing about Cordura that I can't stand is if you have a dog, and we have three, it like collects dog hair. The only saving grace for that is if you just wipe it off with some water, it comes right off. So keep that in mind when getting Cordura. It does collect everything that you set it down on. So let's open it up. And it opens up like this. I just threw some dude wipes in there really quick and some band-aids in case I need some boo-boo kit stuff. Um, and honestly, one of the reasons that I picked this up was the like different color interiors. I actually asked for yellow, but I got this green. Um, but that's fine because this is actually super cool too. I just wanted to get something different than the orange and uh, there we go. So it's a uh, high vis uh, like lime green, super cool. Does say STW right there, USA. I will link uh, the information to this pouch in the description, uh, the Etsy website for the, uh, the uh, STW uh, site. So I just put a few things in here. You only have one, two, three, four, five spots. That's it. And when they say gripper elastic, as you can see, this elastic has like this rubber grip on it. So your stuff doesn't slip around inside, which is actually super cool. Um, so you don't have to worry about it coming out. So I'm blocking the sun, but if, oh, you can't see it. It's super sunny out here, but this is like so bright. <laughs> like it really is. I actually might like this better than the yellow. So whatever, it worked out. So these one, two, three spots right here will only hold something small. Like uh, this is a Nightcore Tube V2. This is a chapstick. I, um, I did have the SD in there, but I don't need it in there today because I have the compact over here and the scissors are in there. And obviously this one, these two uh, slots will hold something a little bit larger because, you know, um, it's longer. So I have the uh, SAK Compact and the Teal Design Slim Jim Pry Bar in there. Um, so I'll also link the Teal Design's website uh, in the description so you can check out Teal. Also made 100% in the United States. Teal Designs is in Virginia. Check it out. Pick up some pry bars. Super solid, as you can see, uh, without taking it out. The thickness of this thing is insanity. Um, so that's cool. And it has uh, an attachment point inside. If you want to put your keys or something in there, you're good. And the cool thing is about it is when you close it, you can see that there's this boxed, boxed out section. It's kind of boxed out. So you can get something right in the middle. That's why I put that stuff in there. But you can actually get something else in there, um, larger. I put other things in there. Um, and it will hold um, other things. Um, today, what do I have? I have the uh, James Brand. Folsom. If I put that in there, that'll go right in and it'll zip right up as you can see. So you can put another knife in there if you wanted to or other gear, just whatever you want to put in there to um, fill that void or just don't put nothing in there. I mean, whatever, it's up to you. Um, but you can do that as you can see. So um, I just threw some boo-boo kit stuff in there. Carry this around today. Good to go. I don't have to carry uh, other stuff. I wanted to get some use out of this. 
zip it right up and you're good to go but the one thing is it's not going to fit in your pocket it is not pocketable it's obviously you know pretty uh thick it says 1.75 but i don't know i didn't actually measure it um i didn't even try to put it in my pocket i mean it'll go in your hoodie pocket put it in a coat put it in a bag you know modular carry that's cool or just hand carry it i mean that's not bad either because it's not huge obviously um so you can hand carry it pretty well but definitely check it out um it's definitely a solid build made in the united states if you're looking for something like that really good uh superior threadworks stw again i will put the link in the description as well as the link to the teal designs website for their pry bars you guys have a happy Happy New Year.